Welcome back to News 12 this morning. All right, folks, I'm being honest here. I don't know much about this, but we're going to tell you more about an amazing event that is coming up, an arm wrestling competition that you can go check out right in our area. And joining us now to tell us all about it is Christopher Griffith. We also have Lorraine, Robbie, and Ed here with us this morning. They are telling us more about this competition coming up on May the 20th. How are you guys? Thanks for being here. Doing great. We appreciate you having us. Thank Absolutely. You. Tell us a little bit about this. It's coming up on May the 20th. Well, me and me and uh, me and Larry got got together and decided that uh, we were going to throw a big tournament with a lot of uh, a lot of high talent in the 154. So we uh, we come up with this, and uh, Larry actually set it up. He uh, he's got all the contacts with all the guys, and uh, they decided to do so. So we just decided to have it here in Chattanooga because. We like Chattanooga. Let's talk about some of the training that goes into this. You Chattanooga. said you've been arm wrestling, Larray, since yeah. you were five years old. Yes. Tell us a little bit about what you do. Um, mainly, it's just really technique. You know, some people think it's all about strength, but it's not. Like, there's a lot of technique and different things that you can learn on the table. It's really a martial art because there's a lot, a lot of different things to it. Christopher, tell us a little bit about what Robbie and Ed are doing right now, some of the moves that they're doing right now. Well, Ed's trying to go inside here. He's pressing at the moment. How long does it take for one of these competitions usually to take place? It, it, as far as the length of the whole comp the whole tournament? As far as one, two individuals going? Oh, it could last 10 seconds. It could last seven minutes. Seven minutes, it wow. It just depends. That is a lot of strength that you've got to hold on to for yes. seven minutes. Now, you have people from all over the country, all over the scenic city, all over the south, really coming to this event on May the 20th. Yes. Where do some of these competitors come from? Uh, we've got some people coming out of... Um, They're everywhere. we got o Ohio, Iowa. Uh, Iowa. We have one guy who's currently ranked second. Um, he's actually from Ukraine. Yes. He relocated to the United States, but yeah, they're from everywhere. It's all across the country. And Robbie has been training and now he's going overseas, correct? Yeah. He's he is he is going to qualify for East versus West in Virginia on May, uh, not May, uh, June 3rd. June 3rd. Yeah. Yes. If folks would like to check this out, tell us again how they can do it, how they can get tickets. They can show up at the at the at the facility. It's uh, called Bruin Q. Bar and Grill. It's right on the state state line, Georgia Tennessee state line, uh, 1750 Rossville Boulevard, I think, or 5017. Go check it out, folks. It's going to be again at the Bar and Q. You said Bar 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 and Q. Brew and Q on Rossville Boulevard. Folks can go check it out yes. and go watch all the arm wrestling that's going to be yes. taking place. They're still going. Oh, yeah. Still, no, but yes. we don't have a winner yet, do we? Oh, we do. We just got a winner there. Congratulations, guys. Thanks so much for coming on the broadcast and telling us what you all are going to be doing coming up on May the 20th. We appreciate it. We appreciate you. Thank you. All right. If you would like some more information about this interview, please go check out our website at WDEF.com. Dave and Chip are going to get some more tips coming up. Maybe we'll see what happens. We'll be right back.